finally on the market, what do you say overall about the risk and equities or about parts of the market that you feel more comfortable? It sounds like healthcare would be one of them. Yeah, it is. We're sort of positioning for this, you know, stagflation playbook. So we look at factors and we want to own value for inflation protection. So we like areas like industrials and mid caps. You and I have talked about that in the past, but we also want to pair that with quality. So we're looking at sectors like healthcare right now, which was, have really attractive quality elements, great ROE, 30%, better than the S&P 500, solid earnings growth prospects for the year. And frankly, they're the only classically defensive sector that's still trading at a discount. Healthcare is trading about 16 times forward earnings right now. That's a 10% discount to the S&P. Areas like staples, areas like utilities, both trading at a premium. From a macro perspective, we also see the consumer about to go through a huge shift. We don't have fiscal stimulus anymore. Mortgage rates are going up. Credit conditions are tightening. And we think the consumer goes from a what I want mindset more to a what do I need mindset. Sure. And that benefits areas like managed care and pharma. We're going to keep going to the doctor, getting our prescriptions. We might not be buying that extra pair of shoes. I mean, maybe that's just me. Um, but our behaviors are going to start to change as growth decelerates and as we need to be more thoughtful about those trade-offs that we make. Quick, we think healthcare is a good pick for that. Quick final sort of follow-up on that. You know, we did see HCA down big the other day after its earnings revealed they are facing a ton of earnings pressure because of rising labor costs. And firms like Goldman have warned that healthcare could be one of the places where we really see inflation broaden out first. Is this sector potentially at risk of profit margin pressure? Yeah, I mean, I think every sector across the S&P is going to be struggling to maintain the types of incredible margins that we've seen over the last year or so. And wage pressures are going to play a role in that. And, and healthcare could be, a, be a, a victim of that. But we do see great pricing power out of this sector. We do see it, again, importantly, trading at a significant discount. And we think those solid earnings growth prospects for the year are really going to be the most important element in terms of that fundamental case yeah. for owning the sector. All right. Fair enough. Emily, thanks for your time today. Thank you. Emily Rowland.